Hello, News Busted viewers. I'm Jody Miller. Well, seven months ago, many of you contributed to our first News Busted pledge drive, which turned out to be a huge success, so thank you. But later this month, we're going to be kicking off another pledge drive for News Busted because 2014 is getting closer every day. And I would love to see all of you in the new year. So please stay tuned in the next two weeks for information about how you can help keep News Busted going strong in 2014. Please don't let News Busted fade to black. I'm Jody Miller. Let's get started. A number of politicians from both political parties have come out against President Obama's plan to bomb Syria. So here's a question. If white politicians don't support a black president who wants to bomb brown people, is that racist? <laughs> Secretary of State John Kerry said asking for permission to bomb Syria is not the same thing as going to war. Yeah. It's more like forcing Obamacare onto the Middle East. <laughs> Nancy Pelosi continues to lobby support for Obama's planned military action against Syria. In fact, Pelosi said, we have to bomb Syria to find out what's in it. <laughs> President Obama's military threat against Syria now has President Assad wishing he hadn't used chemical weapons. <laughs> Yeah, he now wishes he had just attacked the American embassy in Benghazi instead. <laughs> During last week's hearings on Syria, John McCain was caught playing video poker on his iPhone. Pundits were shocked, you know, that McCain knows how to use an iPhone. <laughs> 40,000 members of the International Longshore and Warehouse Union left the AFL-CIO over complaints about Obamacare. And here's how the major media outlets covered the story. <laughs> well, the NFL season has just started. Unless you're a Tampa Bay Buccaneers fan, they just lost to the Jets. Then your season is pretty much over. <laughs> And finally, George Zimmerman's wife has filed for divorce. She says George is like two different people, a Latino at home and a white guy on the news. <laughs> Thanks for watching News Busted, everybody. I'm Jody Miller. Be sure to subscribe to our videos on YouTube, and we'll catch you next time.